now it will duplicate this layer so you can just make it smaller move it up a bit I've seen this a lot in many tutorials so I'll just show you how to do it just it's set to make it look a bit cooler now on the very thin black solid just highlight that and duplicate it now use your arrow key if you drag it down just press the down arrow and it'll move it slowly down alright that looks right okay now I'd like the all three of those black lines to slide into the screen okay so I'll just highlight all three of those now I'll go into animation oh by the way make sure that your timeline bar is at the very beginning so I've got all three of those black lines highlighted go into animation and apply animation preset now in the presets folder you should see transition movement and I'll use slide straight so now I'll press spacebar to play it now as you can see it is you know, a bit laggy that's because it's rendering and now if I replay it now that it's rendered it'll be nice and smooth okay now once that's finished it would like a text to come in alright now because triple X T illusion triple X you know wanted this introduction I'll include his name um, as he inquired so I'll just select the text tool which I can't currently find so I'll just press T alright doesn't work um, so I'll again go into window and select um, just look for the name of it character now that's the size of your text so you can modify its font um, okay alright here it is so now I'll just insert my text T Lucian now I'll just make that a bit bigger okay now I'll rotate this as well so press W and I'll position it now you know it's just bright white it doesn't really have any color so you can change the color to you know like black and you can give it a white outline make it look a bit cool but you can add a glow effect so just select the text layer go into effect stylize and glow now on glow colors you should see original colors and change it from original colors to A and B colors now you can see it has a bit of a glow at the moment <coughs> alright now at the top you should see glow intensity just change this to 4 and I can see it's glowing a lot now because my background gradient color is green to black I'll use a a light green glow and yeah I'll leave the inside white now on the color phase if you just change this it just modifies it a bit so you can change it to what you want so I'll change it to that you know it's, it looks good and it's easy to read it doesn't actually blind you okay now I'll add an animation to that so again highlight the text layer switch animation apply animation preset and this time we'll go into the text folder blurs oh sorry blurs and bullet train now once I play the whole animation again it will all render and then it will play nice and slow well nice and smooth now 
there you go. Alright. Now when I first started this program I didn't really know how to... I seen loads of tutorials and it just switched from screen to screen. I didn't really see the text animate out and they don't show you how to animate the text out. And I couldn't really find anything to do that. And so once your text is there just let it be there for a couple of seconds give your reader time to read it so I'll go to about the thir third or fourth second and then again I'll highlight the text layer select animation apply animation preset you can go into animate out um, you can go into other ones I haven't really um, used a lot of these so the basic one all you see is fade out slow. This will fade out by character, which means it'll fade out letter by letter. And once this is finished, we'll insert another text. So now we'll insert another text. Um, presents. Again, rotate this. Now the same as before, we'll add a glow effect. So again, highlight the layer, go into effect, stylize and glow, change the glow color from original color to A and B, change the glow intensity to 4, and change color A to a nice green. And the color phase, I'll just click on the other text to see what the color phase was, so as you can see it's two times plus 155 so two times 155 all right so the text is there now and now I make it animate into the screen so highlight it animation apply animation preset Okay, text, blurs, and transporter. Alright, so just let this render. And now I'll add some. Um, flourish and arrow presets from video copilot the evolution preset package that you, you buy on DVD all right now it's coming I'll add a 